If you see the Switch Plans button in your subscription details, it means that the wizard is available for your subscription. Select the button to see a list of subscriptions that you can switch to from your current plan. If you don't see the subscription that you want to switch to, then you'll need to switch plans manually. Another thing to consider is that the Switch Plans wizard can only switch all your users to a new plan. If you only want to switch some users to a new plan, you'll need to switch them manually. If the Switch Plans wizard isn't available, you'll see a message like this one that says, Ineligible to Switch Plans or No Switch Plans. To find out why, position your mouse over the Info icon. A message appears with a short description about why the wizard is unavailable. Select the Learn More link for more information about how to resolve the issue. It's not always obvious which plans you can switch to, or what apps and services are included in each plan. So we've put together a table that outlines your options when you're using the Switch Plans Wizard, and when you're manually switching plans. Table 2 shows you which services and apps are available within each plan. Find this article at aka.ms slash 0365 businessplans.